Hi, I'm Mike Mislove. I'm the Chair of Computer Science. I'm also the Herbert Buchanan Professor of Mathematics here at Tulane. Before I tell you about my research, I want to tell you about our new computer science program that we're building here and give you a quick history. After Katrina, a number of departments at Tulane were closed. One of them was the computer science department. About four years ago, the university decided to reestablish the program and asked me to chair a task force to do that. We decided from the outset that the focus of the program ought to be where we think computer science really is today, and that's at the interface between computer science and other disciplines. We can leverage the research that's going on here in other areas and attract bright students and bright faculty to work on applications of computer science to these other disciplines. So as an example of the sort of research we do, um, I want to bring into the picture a little device here that everybody's familiar with. This is the smartphone everybody has, and I'm going to show you some of the work we do as related on this phone. So for example, here's a Google Maps app, and the way those work is using uh, sophisticated computational geometric tools to understand where you're mapping, where you are, and how you can plan routes. Well, one of our faculty, Carola Wenk, is a computational geometer, and she works exactly in this space. Another app, well, one of the friendly ones is Siri, uh, the um, disembodied person on your phone that will answer questions. And um, this is artificial intelligence. We have a faculty member, Brent Venable, who works um, in AI. She does computational social choice and applications to such things as uh, rotorcraft glide paths to minimize the sound. Another app here is my Walgreens app. And of course, this I can use to refill my prescriptions. And the reason that that's relevant is the drugs that you find um, that are so useful these days often are discovered by research involving computer scientists. And one of our faculty, Ram Metu, will tell you in his video about protein structure analysis that he does, which defines the function of, of proteins and how that work is being applied in drug discovery. So I've told you about all of my colleagues here, and the question is, what do I do? Well, I'm a mathematician, as I said. My interest is at the interface between mathematics and computer science. And so what I'm interested in is building computational models for all the software that runs on this device to be able to prove it's correct. This involves mathematics and logic. I've had a number of students who've worked with me over the years. The most senior of them is a professor of computer science at the um, Imperial College of Science and Technology in London. And he's also the director of graduate studies there. Uh, more recently, two of my uh, students are working at the Naval Research Lab where they are um, exploring classical and quantum information. And the third student who just graduated this August is also going to be working at a government lab. He'll be at the NIST lab in Boulder where he'll be doing quantum information. I have two current students. One is working on probabilistic models for computation and he's just solved one of the long-standing problems in the area. And the other is just beginning his research and he's working at the interface between computational models and artificial intelligence with me and Brent Venable where he's working on analysis of security protocols that are useful in setting up secure communication. So if you're a student, uh, undergraduate student interested in working on computer science and its applications, or if you're a prospective PhD student who's interested in an interdisciplinary degree with computer science as one of the components, or if you're a faculty member who is interested in applying computer science to other disciplines, we hope you'll uh, follow up and, and um, explore with us the possibilities of joining us here. Thank you very much for watching. Mm -hmm.